The world of work is changing. Uh, we are living longer. We are working longer. Our careers are going to be longer than those of our parents and those of our grandparents. And I think because of that, we are going to face far more change than previous generations have. And I think one of the main factors changing jobs, changing the labor market is technology. And if technology changes jobs, it means that we also need new skills to work uh, with these new technologies. And I think if we don't keep up with these changes in skills, if people, if employers, if societies in general don't keep up with these changes in skills, we risk falling behind. And I think this is why the Digital Skills Forum is so important, because it's a challenge that we all face. Uh, we're all in the same boat. And by exchanging, by talking, by identifying jointly the challenges, the problems, discussing them, and also identifying solutions and best practice, I think that's one first and important step in terms of tackling the challenge. There are a number of things that we, that we can do. First of all, we need to talk to each other like we are doing here at the Forum. I think social dialogue where we bring everybody around the table, whether it's employers or workers or um, civil society, researchers, all of us have something to contribute to solving this problem. So I think talking to each other is the first step. I think then we need interventions at every single step of the education system uh, so that everybody from the beginning all the way throughout life so that nobody ever leaves the system has the opportunity to reskill to upskill throughout their lifetimes. Of course, our resources are limited. We don't have unlimited resources. And so we need to be very careful about how we invest these, uh, our, our money, our, our resources. And I think targeting uh, our, on the individuals, on the world, employers also, the companies who need help most is really important, on the most vulnerable workers, on the smallest companies, because we know that those will struggle most keeping up with the changes in the labor market.